Oh right, what's going on guys? Moxification here. So today, I wanted to do a video on this menu that I just found on the internet. So, this menu got sent to me by a guy. Um, he sent it to me about, about four months ago. I think he sent it to me, it, it was probably more than four months ago, it was probably about five months ago, but it was it was around like November last year. So, you know, it was, it was quite a while ago, you know. So, uh, yeah, so I guess we'll get into it. So, this is a TU8 menu, it's a DLL. Uh, the guy sent it to me, a, a guy sent it to me in like private messaging on YouTube. He said, you know, do like a review on it. But this, this was ages ago, so I guess it doesn't really, you know, it doesn't really count now. But... Essentially, I just wanted to do a video on it because I just loaded it up and it looks very similar to uh, Outbreak uh, 2.1 or 1.2. I think it was 1.2, but it, it looks similar, but it's really weird. Like, it's kind of, it's kind of trippy almost. It's got, like, a water shader. Like, it's not even a shader. It's like a water vision and it, like, kind of, it looks really weird. I'll show you what I mean. So, one thing I have noticed with it. It's really glitchy. Like, when I say glitchy, not, like, all the time. Only, like, for example, when, like, picking the map just a minute ago, it just glitched a, a little bit. Uh, we'll do a different map. I was going to do... We'll just do Rust. There you go. Um, it was really glitchy when I started the gaming system. Like, it lagged a bit. It went, like, a little bit. Like, the frame rate really dropped, like, a lot. Like, it dropped, and it took ages to put me into the game. Like, right now, I think it's going to go quite quick. It looks like it's... It's going, no, yeah, it's, it's taking a long time to put me into the game. I guess, I could be wrong, but when, uh, a while ago, when Ethernet was messing around with, you know, menus and stuff, uh, a long time ago, when he didn't have his JTAG, and he was getting me to test stuff, um, it, it was really glitchy. Like, the menu, like, getting the menu in, and it'd freeze when you load the game and stuff, and it was really glitchy, and that's what he just did then. So, maybe it's just, he didn't test it much, or he just did something wrong. But, it, you know, it's, maybe you don't see it, but I, I can I can tell that from time to time you get a little bit of, like, a lag spiky type of thing. or And the frame rate drops. That's it. It's, you know, that that's what happens. But, other than that, it's pretty sick. So, uh, essentially, uh, do you see at the bottom left of, what well, it's not really bottom left, it's bottom of the screen. It tells you what, you know, what to press and stuff, how to open a menu. I think it'd be better if it was a little bit up and a little bit to the right, or a little bit up and a bit to the right. Like, when I say a bit to the right, I mean more to the right, like in the center. You know, because uh, the reason for that is on some people's TVs, aka my TV, um, you actually don't see the full outer layer. You only see kind of like, you'd only really understand it if you, you have the same problem as I do. A few people will have the same problem. Um, from time to time, it would do it with different menus, with different things. It just cuts off a bit of a bit of the bottom, bit of the top, bit of the left, bit of the right, and it's, it, it, that's it, you know, it's just a, a tiny problem that it doesn't really matter, but it's just, it's kind of difficult to see what, you know, the c controls are, but I mean, I can see from looking at the, uh, the whole purge capture, so if I didn't have a whole purge capture, it would be difficult to read what it says, but obviously I know that it's D-pad left to open a menu, D-pad up and down to do stuff, and X to select, and B to go back, so, yeah, so as you can see, um, this menu from here it looks pretty sick to be absolutely honest it looks like as i said before the uh i believe it's called outbreak 1.2 or 2.1 i think it's 1.2 but yeah so it looks a little bit like that um if you've never seen it before i suggest you look it up i think it was one of my first ever videos i think it was my second ever video on youtube on this channel outbreak 2.1 or 1.2 i think it's 1.2 um but yeah so essentially it looks pretty sick um, one problem, only thing I don't like about it, it's just the water effect, purely that, it really messes with my eyes, uh, I think if I, maybe there's a visions menu, let's see if there's something that I can select that will change the way it looks, um, maybe pro mode, no, chrome, how about cartoon, yeah, there you go, that removes it, uh, yeah, that's good, I'm good with keeping cartoon mode on, um, that's the only thing I'd change, um, so yeah, so you've got, first thing is self menu uh, so rank 70 unlock all you've got uh, legit and insane stats and a load of other stuff you've got uh, add accolades add achievements you've got uh, derank yourself which is something that you don't really see in a lot of menus card of classes uh, i think prestige menu would be something that would be good to go there uh you've got a game menu so that's i guess 
for your person, so maybe infections, kind of? Maybe not, I could be wrong. Because some of these things would infect, but not all of them. So yeah, some of them would infect, but like things like no clipping UFO and invisibility, they wouldn't infect. Name sizes would probably infect, and the unlimited ammo probably wouldn't. So it's just like mods, basically. It's like the mod menu. You've got infections, so you've XP infections, GB infections. You've got a weapon menu, so you've got Gold Desert Eagle. There you go, it actually brings it out as well. Um, the default weapon, a Kimbo, load of guns. I think it's better when you actually do it so that it's like... It, you don't have the akimbo of it. I think it's better when you just have the solo gun. Um, when they do the akimbo, it kind of... it. I don't know. It, it just, for me, it ruins it. But, you know, I mean, it's, it's definitely something that... It, it definitely... You know that it's modded when you've got two... Uh, when you've got two interventions in your hands, you know? Uh, but, yeah. So, you've got prestige. Ah, here we go. Prestige. Forgot about this uh, zero prestige. Everyone always forgets about zero prestige. Prestige zero is... A quite a good prestige to be absolutely honest uh, but yeah so definitely forgot about the prestige zero um, fog menu default fog all right default fog is remove fog I think and then blue fog yeah this looks right I think we'll go with the with the blue one the blue one looks right uh, I wonder if there's rainbow no nah, there's no rainbow if there was rainbow that'd be cool um, you've got uh, last one, message menu. So you just got a load of messages. Menu created by I think you'd pronounce it XC Kraut. I could be wrong on that. Uh, you got a load of other stuff. You got Skype there. You have got a uh, load of stuff. And it, you know, Project Kraut V1. I, I guess it's Kraut. Uh, and then yeah, you got a load of other stuff. Um, so what I'm gonna do is. Uh, I'm going to obviously give a download link in the description. I'm not sure how stable this is because obviously, you know, at, at the start I did speak about how it was a little bit glitchy for me, you know, like getting into games and stuff. Maybe it's fine. I could be wrong. Uh, maybe it's maybe it's totally good, you know. Maybe it's as stable as, you know, Iconry, you know. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure. But uh, essentially, it looks pretty good. Um, it looks uh, pretty simple, but it, I mean, it, it looks pretty good. It's got quite a, quite a nice sort of way with it but I, I didn't like the water vision bit it didn't really look that good there's one thing i wanted to say before i end the video um there is in the download there is actually you get an instructions folder uh well not instruction folder you get a instructions text document you get the dll you get the default and you get an xex and i'm not sure what the xex is for i don't know why you'd need it for this and so i'm not sure what it does I will put it into the download, but I don't know what it's for. So it's just a plugin, you know. That's that's all it is. But I don't know what the plugin does, and so I suggest maybe you look into it. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not sure. Maybe you should ask the creator. I definitely link, you know, some sort of thing in the description. I, I actually looked. I found a video on his channel of the vid, uh, of the you know the download and stuff uh, after he linked it me, and uh, after I loaded it up and stuff, I didn't find a Simpsons post, but. If there was one, I'd link it. So I'd probably just link the guy's channel, you know. Um, uh, maybe he's made some other stuff. It looks like he's... Uh, it looked like he makes, like, BO2 stuff now. Like, you know, BO2 menus and stuff. That's what it looks like he makes. Could be wrong, though. But, you know, we'll see. Uh, I mean, it looked pretty good overall. One thing I didn't like, the water vision. And I'll, you know, I'll keep it like that. Uh, but, yeah, so that's about it. I'll leave the information and stuff in the description. The download link, his channel, you know, uh, all that stuff's. And uh, yeah, so thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video, I guess. Uh, yeah, goodbye.